In WA, we run for all sorts of reasons. Fun, fitness, just to enjoy our great outdoors. Well, next weekend, I want you to pull on your runners and join me in a really unique way to remember some very special West Australians in the lead up to Anzac Day. 100 years ago, our diggers became stuff of legend as they ran through enemy fire on the beaches of Gallipoli. Weaving its way through Kings Park on the 19th of April, the 5 or 10k Gallipoli run is a way for us to get out and actively commemorate servicemen and women who put their lives on the line to protect our nation. And it's an important part of the growing Anzac tradition for many West Australians, including last year's race winner, Roberto Busi, and runner-up, Josh Tedesco. So, boys, how important was it for you to come back and compete this year? Well, Chris, is uh, the 100th anniversary of the Gallipoli landing, where, unfortunately, more than a 1,000 WA lives were lost. So I believe it is very important for us to acknowledge it. Also, part of our freedom is due to their sacrifice. Kings Park is the hub of our Anzac Day activity here in WA. And for Duncan Warren, a former digger and now keeper of the Anzac Memorial, the Bankwest Gallipoli run is more than just setting out for a jog. So, Duncan, how long has the race been going and why is this race so unique? Chris, this is in its uh, 12th year now and it's unique because the number actually means something. It's the distance that uh, Anzacs had to go from leaving the ships to getting ashore at Gallipoli. So, uh, in effect, rather than just being a number, it sort of symbolises what our Anzacs had to endure in going ashore at Gallipoli. This is an event our whole community is being urged to get behind. And the run's major sponsor is keen to encourage more of us to get on board. So Craig, what's Bankwest link to this run? Look, we uh, felt that the Gallipoli Run was a fantastic event for us to be supporting. It's about supporting WA organisations, the legacy of WA, the RSL and Athletics WA. I'm very proud of the $50,000 that's been put towards those charities since we've been involved. And we think this year the event held both here in Perth and Albany is a fantastic opportunity for people to get involved and support the Anzacs. Basically, the more of us that get down here next weekend, the better. Entries close though on Thursday, so you need to be quick. It's pretty simple. All you have to do is log on to our website and click on the Bank West icon. And there's also some details there about that run in Albany that Craig was talking about. In the meantime, though, if you're here in the city, I'm going to see you 7am on Sunday morning, bright and early. Guys?